here's the first haul we had for the Teeny Mates. We got every team. We got the limited edition Steelers and the referee. So I thought that was pretty awesome for getting one box and we happen to get every single guy and two of the special guys. Now it looks kind of cool on the piece of paper with all the teams but it's not really a display and if you move it around everything's gonna fall over so I went and got the Teeny Mates Stadium. It's got a stadium display inside it says it has an exclusive rare figure, a neon orange glow-in-the-dark guy, and hopefully this will be worthy of putting on display. It looks a little cheesy, but that's what I'm going to find out. Kind of cool little collectible pieces. Let's see if they make the display worth having. It says inside there is the NFL standing stadium display high quality storage tin, great, four packs of Teeny Mates and an exclusive neon orange figure. So let's check it out. So here's the Teeny Mates box. Got a sticker on the side saying once again what's inside. Pretty simple, pretty light. Let's take a look what we get. This is just taped to the bottom. The Teeny Mates cover. Looks like it's already folded up and made for you. Pretty simple Teeny Mates collectible figures, just a little paper display, and then has all the team names on there. Okay, and then we got our neon orange guy. Looks like it's a receiver. Looks like it's a receiver though, neon orange. And then one, two, three, four packs, and the back to the stadium here. So something that does not say on the bin, this is series three, which is the receivers. Not a big deal, but it didn't say that anywhere. So I didn't know what series stadium I was buying. It doesn't say on the sticker on the outside. It, let's see. It doesn't say on the stickers that were on the front. But I guess if you look really close, you'll see that the figure, I believe that's one of the receivers, so I guess that's what should have tipped me off. But there you go, not a big deal. We have some packs of receivers to open up. Let's put this here. Let me put this together quick. So there we have the stadium, and I guess I could bring the field in front, but that's kind of silly still. That's not really a display. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this. It's kind of weak. It would be one thing, as you can see on the bottom of all the guys, maybe you can see, there is a hole. So it doesn't fit pencils, so I've already checked. So you can't just use it as a pencil topper, which is unfortunate. Um, you know, kids would like that. But the display would be cool if it had little pegs you could put them in so it didn't fall. But I'll have the same problem I have on my paper where if it's knocked, you know, 32 guys are going to fall down. So I'm not sure how I feel about this stadium, but I guess it is what it is. And you just put all your guys cramped together on it and they're tiered. I guess that's that's it. Let's open up these. Let's open up these four packs of the receivers and see what we got. We could see here that all 32 teams, two figures and two puzzle pieces, 
there's pretty much no way we're going to get enough pieces to make the puzzle. Um, but series three, it says find the camo teeny mate. So let's open one of these up and see what the possibilities are inside. If you watched my first opening, you see you have to cut them all. They don't have slits. They don't have slits to rip them across. So let's open this one up. All right. We got Green Bay. Green Bay guy, Green Bay receiver. And let's compare them to the running backs. There you go. So that's kind of... The receivers look a little bit bigger. Maybe it's just me. Let me let me get a good look at these guys. I guess they're the same. I don't know. The receiver maybe just has a bigger body because his arms are reaching out. But, yeah, let me put these guys up for you. There you go. Oh, and he's down. So we got a Green Bay guy. And we got the Jaguars. Got a Jaguars guy. Two puzzle pieces, of course. And then let's take a look at the little pamphlet. Receivers, once again, it's going to have the two puzzles. And it's going to show all the teams, in case you don't know what the NFL teams are. But then here are the rare ones. It has a glow-in-the-dark, 1 in 64 packs, New England Patriots throwback, 1 in 128, NFL line judge, 1 in 171, Denver Broncos throwback, 1 in 256, and then a metallic gold finish, odds 1 in 512 packs. So those are, I guess, probably the more sought after ones. As you can see here, find the camo teeny mate, 1 in 37 packs. So we got three more to open. Give them a little cut. We got the Bengals and the Panthers. There's the Panthers and the Bengals in a bag. And then a couple more puzzle pieces. Panthers think it's the Bengals. You are wrong, it's the Bears. Cool, so we have the Bears and the Panthers again. Last but not least, we got the Buccaneers and the Denver Broncos. So this is what we get. We get nine different guys, well, eight and the neon orange guy, some puzzle pieces, and the stadium, which I guess is kind of cool to hold all your guys, as long as it's not going to get knocked over, because then it's like putting a puzzle back together, but all the pieces are labeled. And then, of course, you get the tin, which I don't know why you would want a display and a tin, unless you're really into teeny mates. I guess I could keep something in here, I don't know, right? It's a tin. So, anyway, thanks for watching.